hello everyone and welcome to the channel in this video guys I'm going to guide how to upgrade your Windows 10 to Windows 11 so if you are using the compatible Windows on your system so you can directly go to here then go to settings and then go to update and security and you should able to see the options here that your Windows 11 Windows 11 is compatible and you can simply download that button and install that option from there if you are not sure that why you are not getting that option so simply open the Google Chrome and I have the guide for you how you can check it properly what so you need to type here PC health check app okay and go to this link the first link and the exe will be downloaded like this just we need to install it so once you install it I have already installed that PC health check this one just open it once you install it properly and once you install it guys you just need to click on check now and you should be able to see the results here as you can see here I don't have the PC which is higher than i3 and 11 this is 7 generation but it should be 8th and above generation so you can see here my PC is not supported if your PC processor doesn't support the Windows 11 so it's not recommended to install Windows 11 on it but if it's it is supported then you can directly go to this web update and security options if like TPM is not enabled on your PC or secure boot is not enabled on your PC so you can go to your BIOS options and there you can install the uh, you can enable the TPM or the secure boot from your BIOS option but if you don't have these options you are not able to install the Windows 11 on it another way is to install it open Google Chrome simply and we can take help from the Windows 11 ISO file type for Windows 11 ISO go to first link and try to this option multi edition confirm it choose the language United States confirm it and once you confirm it guys simply download it so once you download it the ISO file will be downloaded here and after that once the ISO file is downloaded let me show you if I have downloaded the extracted file you can see here once the ISO file is downloaded just right click on it and simply extract it even you can mount it open and once you mount it you just need to run this exe and once you run this exe guys just wait here like this it will prompt like this and it will spin around for some time and after that it will give you the options like preparing your windows but I'm showing you in the compatible PC guys key files and app option
see here guys just I want to know this next option and once all the updates are passed and all the ticks are passed you should able to see the option keep personal files and app make sure it is <coughs> not gray out if it is gray out like this in this screenshot or even in this as you can see here if the keep personal files and absence gray out so that means that you are not you have not installed the correct ISO on your windows so install the correct windows just here choose the its language from here let me show you how to change its language from here before we have chosen the United State and by this way there will be no loss to your data you can see here guys the option I was talking about choose here this time international language that means that you have to download the Windows 11 file twice if you are not getting this option keep personal files and app and I'm pretty sure if you apply these method guys you should able to install Windows 11 on your compatible Windows okay so I hope this video helps you if yes then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching